First offensive snap from the 20 yard line. Play fake, Carpenter rolls to his right. Now he steps up, throws, caught by Miller. And that's gonna be a first down to the 32 yard line. And it was Brent Miller, the brother of the more heralded Zach Miller, who's been making more and more catches defensively for the Wildcats. And you heard Jim Watson talk about this unit. The down four has been getting pressure on the quarterback, and that's one of the keys. The linebacking core, yes, as Waddy said, they've been healthy all year, and they have been a solid unit. And of course, when you talk about guys like Kaysan and Fontenot in the corners, that makes you a pretty darn good defensive team. Well, they're really able to do a lot of things with their linebackers and safeties when they have guys that can lock you up on the edges. And trust me, Kaysan can do it, and so can Fontenot. Give this time to Terrain. Nothing doing. Lost about two yards. Spencer Larson on the stop. And the crowd really into this game, no question. Well, this game is going to come down to whether or not Arizona State can run the football and get five yards on first downs with Ryan Terrain. He can go over 1,000 yards in this football game. All he needs is 70 yards, but he has got to get going. He's got to get going forward. And Arizona is going to get into that backfield and try to cause as much trouble for him as possible. They're going to try to get him to change his direction before he gets his momentum going. If he gets his momentum going, he's going to have a good day. First down, or rather second down, and 12, and here is Terrain, and Terrain gets nothing. Runs right into Spencer Larson, who stands him up and knocks him backward. Second tackle in a row for Larson, and he is the leading tackler on Mike Stoops' defense. 81 tackles coming into this game. Eight and a half TFLs, and that's a lot by far. Leads the team. This is a guy that has a great motor, and just like you said, Barry, and just like Waddy said, He's been healthy all year. And they're a really good defense, especially in the Pac-10, one of the best. Well, you can see that against very good teams. They did not give up very much. Now it's third and long. DeWitty comes in on passing downs. The blitz comes, they pick it up. And the pass is caught this time by Jones for a big first down for the Sun Devils into Arizona territory at the 39-yard line. Now there's a famous rapper named Mike Jones, but that's not him. This is Mike Jones, the receiver, just a sophomore on the three deep earlier in the season. He's up against Kaysan, and Kaysan slips down and falls. And that just goes to show, if a man is open, Rudy Carpenter is going to find him. That one for 26 yards, he's going to find him downfield. But there have just not been receivers getting open consistently for Carpenter to find. They did a great job picking up the blitz, too. So their first down, this is Dimitri Nance. Guy who has not had too many carries. Gets it inside the 35, taking people with him. Down about the 31 yard line. He picked up about seven, maybe eight yards on the play. Every rivalry game we do, there's always somebody. There's always a guy that kind of steps up that you don't expect to step up. Dimitri Nance is the third string back. Only about 194 yards on the year. But that time, getting upfield and getting his legs going, fresh legs count for a lot at the end of the year. A true freshman, Nance will come out. Terrain will come back. It's exactly what the Sun Devils want, moving the football. They've got a second and short now. Second a little bit less than two. Nickel defense for the Wildcats. There's a give this time to Terrain, and Terrain will have the first down close to the 25-yard line. That was a really nice run by Ryan Terrain. And you see what I mean when he gets his momentum going. He just gets down the field in a hurry, and you can't tackle his upper body. People just sliding off him. He's going to go forward. Finally, Lewis Holmes gets him down, but not before a nice gain and another first down. Exactly what Arizona State wants. No question. This is what they wanted to start. It takes the crowd, if not out of the game, and at least quiets them. Carpenter going to go up with time. Steps up, looks end zone. Got a man. McGahey, touchdown. That was a thing of beauty. Very nice drive by the Sun Devils. And Rudy Carpenter threw that right into the teeth, into the strength of the Wildcat defense. Antoine Quezon, one of the best corners in the country, and Dominic Patrick both in the area. McGahey gets behind both of them. That's just his third touchdown of the season. 
and a big time drive by Rudy Carpenter and the Sun Devils to start out this game on the road. No question about it. And they were able to run the football, and that, of course, made a huge difference. Well, Carpenter engineering what has to be the best drive that ASU has had in a long time. Extra point is put through by Ainsworth, and with 11.32 remaining in the first quarter, ASU leads it 7 to nothing.